Most amazing of all undertakings is the Autopista, a 10-mile-long highway between Caracas and the seaport city of Laguayla. The only bridges in the world made of 97% concrete and 3% steel, a brand new idea in bridge construction, are being built by a French firm. The largest pre-stressed concrete bridge in the world, 820 feet long, 220 feet above the ground. It is 600% cheaper to build. Robert Chama is the engineer. Here is the bridge as it looked in the early days of construction, and another view as it looked nearing completion. Venezuelan engineers are in overall charge of the project, which is costing $6 million per mile, one of the most difficult roads to build in the world. More dynamite per mile had to be used on the autopista than on any other highway in South America. Building through the solid rock foothills of the Andes is far from child's play. Two thousand workers and over two hundred bulldozers, tractors, trucks, and other types of equipment will eliminate 300 tortuous curves on the old route and cut driving time from one hour to only 20 minutes. Here is how turnipoles drag dirt on a 60 degree slope to fill up a ravine. Two giant tunnels, the last word in engineering, have been cut through solid rock. One of them is over a mile long and has its own system of air conditioning. Both will have daylight type lighting assuring perfect safety. This is the start of the autopista, a 350 foot cut, one of the longest and deepest ever made. And this is the seaport of La Guayra, where 50% of Venezuela's imports arrive. The autopista starts here. Close by is Maiketia Airport, serving Caracas. In the background, you can see the new highway. Maiketia is one of South America's busiest air terminals, enjoying perfect flying weather the year round. Non-stop flights reach New York in eight hours, and you can fly to Europe in 19 hours. In stride with the advancements in aviation, jet planes have been ordered by the Venezuelan airlines. 